after sitting here on <clears throat> Monday of the rifle deer hunt, Maddie's first opportunity to get out with her rifle. She did real good with the muzzle of missed twice, but dang close. <clears throat> you gonna do better today? Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. Jason's got two deer spotted already, so uh, we'll start this one off right onto the phone scope. Here we go. <laughs> So close, I can't zoom out. Give, 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 Give him a thumbs up. Yeah, he bumps. Nice, let's go. It's a three. Huh? It's a three. It's a three. Yeah. I can now finally attempt a thousand yard shot with my reload. Because we have a range finder in the range yet. Yes, well, what do you think, guys? We found a buck or two. They're not big, but they're definitely Maddie shooters. Mm -hmm. Do we make a run up that ridge? I think from getting up here by this, up here on top of this little area, we can see across to that that flat where they're at. Okay. We get over here onto this clearing. This is what? We got uh, about 10 deer up there. They're a long ways away. Of course, Jace always spots them a long ways away. Um, but he thinks there might be a buck in one of them. Oh, he said for sure two. Buck. That one's for sure a buck? Yeah, it's a good three. Good three? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a long ways away. Yeah, it is. It's like clear over there. <laughs> what do you think? I don't know. Should we walk that way? Or should we keep on our plan going this way? I don't know. <laughs> I guess we'll see. an old goat. But we gotta pop up on top of this ridge then run the ridge back to where, uh, where we can get a better look at that buck. And then Maddie will decide whether she's gonna take a shot or not. So here we go. Even though I'm still tired. Hey Dad, did you notice something on the spotting scope? That black thing's not there anymore. Mm -hmm. I don't know, that buck, oh he missed, he's shooting at that big buck. Oh, he dropped it. Dude, he shot it, that hit me. He dropped, down the hill. he dropped that buck. You video on that rolling down the hill? I videoed him kill it. You videoed him kill it? Oh. Yes, I really shot right? that buck. It's like right by the tree. Yeah. Just that tree there. You gotta be kidding me. <clears throat> Find the hunters. I mean, I guess I well, we we're sitting here glassing. We got up to our spot and we had relocated the bucks. <clears throat> they were kind of feeding our direction. We were going to let them feed down into this draw right here. Where we had a good look at them. And um, what just happened? Someone shot it. <laughs> Someone just tipped it over. We watched the whole thing. We got it on video. Jason got up on the phone scope. He was recording. Shot cracks off. <clears throat> a couple of shots. He missed buck. the first one, I think. Yeah, I think he missed the first one. The buck tips over and rolls down the hill. Jace got it on video for us. So I guess we won't shoot that buck, will we? Nope. <laughs>
Do you leave that fire going so Maddie stops freezing or what? Both. <laughs> nice. You didn't even bring a lighter so you could light the thing. There she go. Well, we've stayed here for quite a while, had a nice fire. It was Glassed warm. Up. It was warm. <laughs> Glassed up a few more deer, but no bucks. So we're going to move on. Yeah, it was a bummer. We're going to move on, see what we find. Look at that. You see that? Right on the side of the road. Doing three fawns. What the heck? Ooh, so, we went home and grabbed some lunch after this morning's events, and uh, Maddie had something come up, so she didn't come back out with us. So it's just me and Jace to, this evening, and we're making a, a bonsai run. Let's see if we can get back to a spot that we really like back in here. So, sorry for the hard breathing, but we're moving fast. Jason and I got back here to where we pulled up a camp for the night. And we're going to sit here and glass the remainder of the night. It's a great view. You can see a big face here, a big canyon back this way, and then another big canyon back this way. <clears throat> so we've got a lot of glassing to do here. We've already turned up about six dozen fawns. So we'll keep looking and see what we can find. We got a nasty storm that just rolled in on us, but Chase has picked up a buck way up high. We're gonna put you on the phone scope real quick and see if we can get a better look. He looked like a good buck. Oh, dang it all. Well, there's the one that got away for the night. If it had come off that hill, <clears throat> even just another. 20 yards down towards us, I'd have taken a shot at him, but skylined, not a chance, and he bedded right there for the night. <laughs> I can see that one in the spot. We should uh, turn his head. I wish you could stand up and not turn your thumb right there. Oh, good day though. A couple good bucks. A lot of animals. I didn't see an elk though. Not one. Nope. Yeah, that'll wrap up this video. Good day on the mountain. Saw a lot of uh, animals. And saw a couple good bucks. Just didn't get shots at either one of them. But yeah, good day on, on the mountain. Couldn't ask for anything more. But thanks for watching to the end, guys. If you are not subscribed, please subscribe to our channel. We are so close to reaching that thousand mark, and we would really appreciate it. If you like what, uh, what you see from Nimrod Outdoors, give us a like on the video. Leave us a comment. We try to respond to every comment that's on, the, on YouTube. So uh, check us out on Instagram and uh, Facebook, and we will see you on the next video.